coughs are basically divided into two types, dry cough and wet cough. DRY cough is a type of cough that produces little or no mucus or sputum. It is closely related to cough and often, these terms are used interchangeably. Dry cough is usually the result of an infection caused by colds and flu. It can also be triggered by atmospheric pollutants like cigarette smoke that irritate your throat. In most situations, a dry cough occurs because your throat or throat is irritated or inflamed but can also arise from deep in the chest. People with a dry cough will feel lumps in their throats. Others may feel a sense of tickling and cough to get rid of it but do not find relief. Common causes of dry cough side effects of the drug, some medications, especially antihypertensive drugs, can lead to dry cough. The psychological condition, that is when the cough has become habit. It is also sometimes referred to as neurological cough. There is no cough and usually the person does not even notice that they are coughing. One characteristic of this cough is that it disappears when people sleep. Neuroses and stress, many people cough when they are in a stressful situation. Breathing becomes shallower when you are anxious, and this can trigger cough reflexes. Some people tend to be more anxious than others, and for them, natural coughing may become a problem if they experience uncomfortable situations. Normally, the basics will have to be addressed to cure the dry cough. Viral infections we know are common colds and flu. Coughing spells can occur when the illness starts or is more likely to occur in the middle or late infection and can last long after other symptoms have disappeared. Allergies can also lead to dry cough. Hey, an allergy to grass and pollen irritates the eyes and nose, and when the throat is affected, the result is cough. If you are not sure about the cough or not, you can try it out quickly. Sensitivity to other particles such as fur, called allergic rhinitis, can also lead to the same symptoms. Air pollutants can cause irritation in the throat causing coughing. This is the situation when a person does not smoke in a smoke room. Acid reflux is accepted as the cause of dry cough. What happens is that the acid in the stomach goes up behind the throat. The acid minutes can then enter the upper respiratory tract, causing inflammation and coughing. This can happen when people lie flat. Acid reflux is a prominent feature of Gorder-Jurt gastroesophageal reflux disease. Dry coughs may have two or three types. Dry hacking cough, most commonly you see a dry hacking cough which is seen in viral infections of the nose and throat in which you get a continuous cough with a feeling of something being stuck in the throat. Barking cough or croup, the other type of cough is what is called a barking cough or croup, which is mainly seen in laryngitis. Swelling or infection of the larynx. When the patient coughs, there is pain in the throat and difficulty in breathing. Whooping cough, the third type of dry cough, would be a whooping cough, caused by bacteria. This is a very uncommon occurrence because of the presence of vaccine programs run by the government of India. Ionhe Kothazam Kai TIT only trunk TRM. Corrective measures. Home remedies like honey soothe the lining of the tissues behind the throat. Common medications such as cough suppressants reduce the coughing reflex. These medications may be prescribed by a doctor or available without a prescription from a pharmacy. Herbal remedies like pine or fruit extracts are ideal for treating dry cough and dry cough from the throat.